Hi guys, Ron here and welcome again in 2019. Today I want to talk about training software because since it's the first day of the year, I think it's a good time uh, to show you something that can help you with achieving your season's goals. So previously I've already shown you uh, the Deepak software which is quite unique in the world of cycling. And since then, uh, the guys working on it have implemented a couple of uh, excellent changes and improvements. So today I want to talk you through about those. So the first thing that has changed is the dashboard. And apart from the design, there are some uh, new metrics that you can log in the dashboard. So apart from the usual uh, dynamic calculated uh, power values, and training stress metrics, you can also uh, see and track your weight over the days, which I haven't been doing yet. Uh, and also, more importantly, I think the training volume that you've done in the last 12 weeks. As you can see, as the weather has been slowly uh, getting worse, I spent more and more time on the trainer, and in the last couple of weeks, uh, I had uh, some easier training weeks just to taper off a little bit and now it's time to tr start the season properly. Uh, apart from that, uh, the usual dashboard features have remained, so the total training volume, as you can see I spent quite a lot, on the a lot of time on the trainer and me and max power uh, and then the individual workouts and of course the dynamic performance management chart uh, with its usual features and predictions. Uh, another neat feature that I've just spotted is the fact that you can actually export uh, the chart uh, and print it or send it to someone for your coach, uh, for example, and it also calculates your total stress, stress score in the last couple of weeks. So all very useful features that you don't really have in Strava, you have them in Training Peaks perhaps, or some other advanced software, but those are really not at the same price point and don't really have the dynamic metrics and calculations that the Deepak software has. So this for me is a very welcome change and definitely uh, looks the part and does the job. Another feature that has been uh, changed uh, is the way how you upload uh, your workouts. You can of course do that manually. For me, it's easier to go through Strava, so even if you have nothing uh, uploaded in here, you can just hit this button, it will upload all your uh, Strava data into here, which you can then edit to actually uh, include the extra information, which is of course uh, the backbone of this software and the dynamic metrics. So. Now this is also a bit more advanced, so you can add how, uh, how you were feeling during the day. So today I had pretty good recovery with good sleep. I don't know my weight, I haven't measured myself, but you can add it here. And also the resting heart rate for me it was uh, 37 in the morning, so let's just add that. That's pretty normal. And how did I feel during the workout? I think I felt good. It felt pretty easy. So, uh, yeah, these are the extra metrics that this software uses in order to give you a better idea of how your training stress is developing. Another new feature is the calculation uh, of the dynamic values itself, so the algorithms have improved. I'm no expert uh, in this, this area, so can't really tell you much more about that, uh, but it's uh, much more precise now. Other features include, of course, apart from the training log, this is just uh, the rundown of your workouts that you've done. Then power records, of course, these remain pretty much the same. Uh, an improvement has been made in the area of the virtual coach, which I find very, very interesting and I'm really looking forward to try this out. Uh, so one feature that uh, immediately caught my attention 
is the very precise rundown of the training zones. Now, for example, in Strava, you don't have this and you don't have uh, an idea of how long uh, these intervals should be if you want to go in these zones to achieve a proper stimulus, which is a uh, mistake that uh, people make. Uh, then you you also have the heart rate zones here, but for me that's not really uh, not really important. And then, since this is a virtual coach, you can of course select what do you want to work on. For example, if you want to work on VO2 Max, this software can build you a workout, which you can then download uh, as a Swift workout and it will do, basically you can do it in erg mode and it will keep you in exactly this, uh, the zones you are supposed to be in to achieve your desired goal. And another new feature is called season planning. Here you can add some goals uh, for your key events and according to this then uh, the virtual coach takes this into, in, into consideration and sets up your tapering and your workouts. Uh, my most important season goal, I've already talked about that a lot, is the uh, national ITT, but there's not much information about that. Uh, but yeah, I guess uh, the date is going to be the same as usually, so the last week of June. But anyway, uh, this can also be really helpful if you're not uh, an experienced, experienced rider and can use some help with the coaching. Then if you want to get even more help with your training, then there's an option now in the settings tab to actually invite a coach that's already registered in the Deepak software. Uh, so this way he can monitor uh, and guide you through your training data and set workouts and goals for you uh, so you um, achieve the highest possible effectivity of your training work. If you like this software as much as I do, then there's of course an option of a free 30 day trial uh, if you want to give it a go yourself. And if you're interested uh, in getting a premium account, then this is probably the best chance uh, to get that because for my, you, my viewers, I have a 10% discount code which you can find in this video and you can apply that uh, for your next premium subscription. If you want to know more about my training, then don't forget to tune into the channel and subscribe. It's all for today and thanks for watching.